for all its inconveniences, Lang was satisfied with life in the high rise, ready to move forward and explore life. How exactly? He had not yet decided. I'm so sorry. I'll survive. I thought you were empty. I just moved in. You're an excellent specimen. Why don't you come up later and have a drink? You don't know how things work around here, do you? I'm a fast learner. You built all this. I put all my energies into this town, but I am the architect of my own accident. Is that a horse? Probably. On the 40th floor. Your husband appears intent on colonizing the sky. And who can blame him when you look at what's going on at street level? How's the high life? Prone to fits of mania, narcissism, and power failure. We pay the same charges as the top floors. We want our fair share of the power. Things would be better if we could afford to move to a higher floor. I think we should be prepared to meet moderate resistance. The ones who are the real danger are the self-contained types like you. <laughs> Perhaps you're right. What are you doing? What are you doing in there? Teething problems. The building's still settling. Doesn't it seem odd that a man can fall from the 39th floor and not one police car turn up? Where's the sirens? What have you got there? A kaleidoscope. What can you see through that thing? The future.